So if you like the idea of using Pear Deck to help speed up your attendance process and start class out and get kids interacting right away, what you can do is take this slide right here and put in your student names. Uh, one way to do it would be typing. Um, of course, that's a lot of names probably, so I'm gonna show you a way to do it via copy and paste. So I'm gonna get my list of student names from Canvas. So I'm gonna go over to my uh, biology class and I'm gonna click on my grade book. And then from actions, what I'm gonna do right here is click on export. And what that will do is it'll start the export process, which basically takes your grade book in Canvas and makes a CSV file of it, which can be read by um, Excel, Google Sheets, or any other spreadsheet program. So it looks like it's downloaded. Um, so what I'm gonna show you is how to upload it to your Google Drive and um, sort it a little bit, manipulate it a little bit so it's um, ready for you to cut and paste. So I'm gonna go to New, and I'm gonna do a file upload. And you'll see that um, it names the file with um, the date and time and then the uh, course name. So this is the one that I just exported right here. So I'm gonna choose that, click open. And then it'll start uploading. You can see here down in the corner, it's already complete. When I click on this, it'll go to the file and it'll ask me if I wanna open it with Google Sheets, which I do. So I'm gonna click on that. So here it is opened in Google Sheets. Uh, the first thing I want to do is um, delete some of the, the data in here that I'm not going to need and it's just going to get in my way. So you don't need the second row. So I'm going to click on the second row with only points possible. And I'm going to right click and then I'm going to choose delete row. And for this use case, I don't need the ID as a SIS user ID or the SIS login ID. So I'm gonna select all those and delete those columns. And then I really don't need anything after this section. Uh, so I can scroll over to the very end of this. Oh, in this case, it's column Z. I'll hold shift down and click on column Z and then again right click and I'm going to delete column C through Z. So there we have it. Um, there's, there's my data. Uh, now what you can do is you can add a filter. So I'm just going to select these two columns, go to data and then click create a filter. And notice it, it did something special. I now have this icon right here. And this makes it easier for you to filter your data and get what you want uh, quickly. So I'm just going to click right here and I don't want period one. I just want my saved by the bell class here. So I just want to see period two. So I say, okay, if they need to be sorted, you know, Z to A, I, I can do that or A to Z. They were already sorted by their last name. So um, there you have it. And now I'm going to copy these names. And notice over here in the right hand corner at the bottom, it says count six. That's important because there's 14 rows in um, the template, in the Pear Deck template. So don't copy more than 14 at a time. Just copy up to 14. This class only has six, so uh, it's just an example. So I'm going to copy that, uh, Control C or con uh, Command C. Then I'm going to go back to Pear Deck, this template right here, and you can either select all of these or just the, the top one, and then you're just going to do a paste. Now notice um, it repeated because it, you know, the last person was um, uh, Lisa, and then it just started repeating. So if I did didn't select all of them, I just select the first. And it would look like that. So either way, and then you would just go back um, to your spreadsheet, um, grab some more names, 14 at a time, come back over here, paste them in, and then it would have all your names and you'd be ready to go. Uh, keep in mind this doesn't like sync. So if you get any late additions or um, 
uh, people that drop your class, you would need to change those manually. But at this point, it shouldn't be too bad uh, and should be manageable. So now you're ready to use this um, Pear Deck slide.